Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Apex Ape in the last part. We did the TV tower and got a bunch of monkeys there. In this part, we're going to move on to the oh, next yeah. level, and the next level is actually very exciting. So, a crap ton of monkeys, a lot of random crap to do, a lot of random stuff to do. It should be fun. I'm looking forward to it. Why don't we go ahead and... It's Monkey Madness Spectreland! As you might be able to guess, it's an amusement park. But of course, it's not very amusing because it's trying to kill you the entire time. But it's going to be fun. Welcome I guarantee you. This level is actually one of my favorites. I've been expecting you, Hi. but we're not here to no have fun. This is all about payback. You've ruined my plans oh. one too many times. I want to have fun. You've captured have some fun. of my soldiers, and in return, I've decided to take your little friends. If you want them back, you'll have to play a simple game of hide and seek. You see, I've Ooh, hidden like the that. professor and Natalie somewhere in the park. <laughs> the professor's an enemy. The professor before something terrible okay. happens. The soldiers oh in the what? area are angry wait, and wait. ready for retaliation, and I won't be oh responsible for their actions. <laughs> what? Take a look around. You're, you're like murdering people. Just I just captured you. your monkeys. Are you ready for I didn't kill them. Life? I guess the people I send them to might kill them. Oh my god, that'd be so depressing. And they're cute. <gasps> Sandy, did I catch? I oh, know I didn't capture Sandy. We're good. <laughs> like some of the monkeys are cute. I don't want them to die. Like those ones were like, I'm just sad. I don't want to kill them. I just want to make them happy again. Maybe they like being in captivity. They got like, I mean, think about it. They get free food. People clean their shit up. Of course, people might uh, like, throw shit at them, like be mean to them. But some humans think like go in there, and, like stare at them and say, "Aw." I guess I, I don't know if I would like that actually. That'd be kind of weird. Like if I, if I was in a cage and people walked in and be like, "Oh, you're so cute." I'd, well, I guess it'd be nice and comfortable. <laughs> I don't think I know. I'm, I don't know where this is going. But as you might expect here. It's an amusement park, and it actually has four or five different areas for us to explore and try and find people. Of course, we can't go in there quite yet, we have to go there later. I believe you can only go in there after you find Depressor and Natalie, so let's go here to Western Land first. I mean, at first, this, in hindsight, this kind of looks like a Mario Party level. But yeah. Here, you don't want to slingshots, very much so, and on top of that, I believe, there's just like monkeys everywhere and they're all sharpshooters, so it's gonna be a good old time. There's one monkey up here, he already sees me, for God's sake. Let's look at all of them. Here's Code Cloy, who can't stand this expense. I can't speak today, apparently. There's actually two monkeys in the house in front of us, and I believe there's only three or four here, so... And there's a Spectre coin beneath- oh god. Yep, there's, there's the shark shooting begins. I'm gonna go ahead and knock him off, but like... Sorry, I'm like having a bit of like, a standoff with this monkey. Oh god, he can your bomb at me! Okay, well... Okay, monkey, it's on! It's on like Donkey Kong. Which is actually kind of a relevant saying here, even though it's probably copyrighted and I'm gonna get my ass soon. I don't know! No, oh, oh my. Yeah, I think I got him. No, I didn't get him. Okay, I'm gonna. No, I used to use the homing ones before I die here. He's gonna kill me here, I think. Got him. Come down here, you stupid monkey! No! Where do you think you're going? No, where do you think you're going? Okay, well, okay, well, okay, oh. I said okay, wait a minute. Okay, I'm not going over there actually because there's monkeys in those windows that shoot at you. There are bombs and stuff, and I'm not ready to handle that yet. <laughs> I'm not mentally in the right place for this. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and trap him in the corner, shoot him, get over over here, let me call that out, shoot him, and then grab him right here. Got him, okay, cool. So back away a little bit because I think the monkeys in there will shoot at me. They seem to be taking their sweet time at shooting me, but you know, I'm not complaining. To make this as easy as possible. I think there's nothing over here, actually, isn't there? There's a health thing, that's cool. So go ahead and pull up my slingshot here, and ready in the window. They'll... Oh, there's three of them? There's three? I thought there's like two. You knock them off like that, and they're only stunned for a little bit, and immediately after being stunned, they'll run to that door and go back to the hiding spot. So that makes it a little bit more difficult. Like, this one here in particular, he gave me a lot more trouble than that, but like, I kept knocking him off and he just get back up. So I think he got kind of lucky there. Oh, I just missed it. Let me get you. Stupid monkey. Ow! Oh, we just like snipe each other. That's cool. Ow, no. Rude. Okay, you monkey. I can't see you. If this camera angle will let me. Okay, well. No! Okay, this monkey's about to like wreck me. Oh, no, okay. This monkey, that monkey is like. He literally like. 5 to 0 on me. Oh my god. Oh, I thought it was kind of funny actually, like. This is in hindsight, because I didn't actually think about this before I recorded or decided to let's play this game. One of my favorite moments in my Radiata Stories Let's Play is I don't know if you guys remember the. Okay, this... okay I got him this one. Okay, no, I didn't. Oh. This monkey's you like take out eight lives, isn't he? What's your name? I, know... I need to know his name. Flea. Flea is my mortal enemy from now on. Actually, the monkey from the last level is still. Oh my. 
No, I try, <laughs> I try to predict him and he's like, he's like, he's smarter than me. God, this monkey's better than me. Oh my god, this is so hard. But I don't remember, if, if, for those of you who watched my Lord Audio stories, that's why. Got him! Oh my god. No, 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 I'm not playing this again. That, that railing totally just saved my... God, this is so hard. Why, why is this monkey giving me so much trouble now? Okay, well, I just lost two lives on the same monkey, and that's not even saying, like, there's an upcoming thing that's even harder than this, so... This is boding well. But for those of you who've seen my Radiata stories, let's play one of my favorite moments, and that was the... I was doing a mission for someone. I don't remember who exactly. Oh, I got him for sure this time. It was, oh, it was one of the side missions you can do from Thanos. And I was running around, basically... I went back to the Dwarven... What's it called? I went back to the Dwarven Town. God, I, I can't remember what it's called anymore. But I was going through there, and I was going through the mines, and of course at the time I was like over drastically overleveled for the mines, and I was just wasting my time doing these random battles. And then... No, I was doing the, yeah, I was doing the Grave Digger thing. Not the Grave Digger, but the Grave Muncher. I forget what it's called exactly. But... I was running through the mines, and I was actually getting low in time, and I wanted to finish the side quest in that part. So I was like really hurrying. And then all the monsters respawned my way back out, so I was like well, even wasting even more time. But what I thought was so funny about that was like... I run into like, there's an enemy that was a monkey in that game, and I kept running into them, eventually one time I got so frustrated, I just literally shouted like, FUCKING MONKEYS! And that's like one of my favorite, like going back and looking at it, that's one of my favorite moments of uh, the Let's Play. Like, I just, I just go back and watch that sometimes and laugh, because it's like, I just lose my cool so something so stupid I lost my cool. I was just, oh, that was hilarious. But anyways, this little thing right here is actually like, the most evil part of this game, if you ask me. This, this part is like literally impossible to do in your first time. Like, I don't know how many of you have played the... A rhythm game called Osu, where it's basically like, I call it DDR, but you click. But it's basically, you need insanely good reaction times, and honestly, like, I had to play this, I went there like four or five or six lives on this, my practice run. It says, I didn't check their controls. I think jump is, yeah, if you jump is R1. Basically, you're in this thing, there are going to be little things blocking your path, and the best part is Jake set this up for us, apparently, so I don't know why exactly it's so devious. But basically, watch in front of you, and you'll see a little gate, you need to jump up like that, you need to jump over it. And they barely give you any time. So like, I used to hit that one. Thankfully, that gave a little before warning of that one. Oh no, okay, made it, actually. No, oh god. See, they give you, like, no forewarning in half of these, and it drives me insane. Jump. You, you see that one coming a mile away, I'm sorry. I actually really need to focus on this, because I don't want to spend too much time on it. I feel, I feel the need to jump again, on. I jumped over the fucking Spectre Coin! Oh my god. You know, oh my. Out of all the things, the jump! Are you serious? Okay, sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm starting to cast again. I'm like falling back in that. I made it to the second room first try though. Were they even. I don't even think there are five jumps. I don't think it's possible to die before that. But this room, if I remember correctly, is like evil. There must have been like some sort of like psychology thing they did there. Yeah, see, remember this room was evil? No, jump, 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 jump. Oh, okay, okay, well. A for effort. Once again, I didn't jump early enough, so I didn't get this. Oh god, I hate this game. <laughs> Spectre's or no, sorry, that was like kind of a delayed blast, but uh, Spike is like spiraling out of control, blowing up, and the only thing he says is, "This bites." Yeah, I think you'd be a little bit more pain than that, buddy. But you know, this room is a little. My control's going crazy right now. Jump. There's another one right after this. Jump. No one. Jump. Jump. Sorry, I've, oh god. See, I've literally done this so many times that every time I say that. Well, at least I almost hit that one. <laughs> oh, no! Jump! Oh god, okay. I think I'm almost, I'm almost done, I'm almost done, I think. There's like one at the top of here. Oh no! So I'm like really focused. Yeah, I think, I think that's it. I missed both the Spectre coins, but you know, I guess that's something for later. Good god, that thing is evil. I'm surprised I only died once, though. But I absolutely love how, like, inspiring- it's like literally inspiring on a control blowing up, because he's like, This bites! You think- I- Honestly, I think they should've just cut out the voice altogether there, and been like, Leave the kids with speechless and, like, Inspiring and burning up or something. But, you know... That's probably a little too dark for a game like this. <laughs> hey! How's it going? Hey! Well, hey, girl! See, I love my women in cage. I can't make those jokes, I can't reach you from here. I've gotta find a way Why in do you there. look like you're on the other side of the bars? There must be a way in here somehow. 
I remember that they walked me around that way. <laughs> it took a long time. Just find a way and get me out of here. Will you hurry up? <laughs> wow, I, I don't even give you a chance to move, okay. will you? See ya. Oh, hurry up. Please get me out of here. It's cold. I'm scared and I have a fear of heights. Oh, no, I should go back. Yeah, I heard that, but I heard that yeah, girl. Yeah, I heard that. Yeah. I know you're scared. I'm gonna come get you. This ain't gonna work. Trust me. I'm gonna die like twelve times doing this. But there are a few monkeys in here. I think a lot of regular enemies in here are also very really annoying. So like these little things that come from your left, I think. Yeah, those. Uh, yeah, those things. Plus this. I even hit that in my practice battle. It's right around the right side here, and it can't hit you. Go ahead and grab some of these. I think I'm getting high on this. Well, I just got baited and I was part of there. Right? Actually, no. I'm like, I'm like really low. Those. I'm gonna go out my way those again. There's things in there. Go hit that. Get a little. Cracker, because I really need crackers right now, otherwise I'm going to die. Because I don't want to die in this, like... The roller coaster is honestly the hardest thing in this game. And I think I still had... I was still... I still oh, excuse me, I'm like stepping my words here. I got a little lucky, because I think I played that relatively recently enough to know that... Uh, Porto talks himself. No, to know that, like, that second... The, the second room, there's like four or five consecutive children friends beginning there, so I was kind of... I had that in mind. I had that in mind. I shouldn't even bother. Is there, like, one of those things behind me? I don't know where he- it probably came from that green thing right there. I think there's something we bash open here? It's not right here, is it? No, because we can't do that yet. Is it here? Yeah, we- okay, yeah, you bash open this wall. And some crap in here. I'm gonna go ahead and try to beat these things as fast as possible, otherwise they'll kill me. And they drop health though, that's, that's really nice. There's a lot of them. Jeez, is that where they were coming from, the other side of the wall? That'd be kinda cool if it was. I think it is, actually, but... You know. And here's another one of those steps that apparently you can, <laughs> you can climb. I like the, no, yeah. I like those like the stairs in the Spectre's Castle or Crumbling Castle a while ago. Like I tried crawling up. Actually, maybe you can't crawl upstairs. No, I had to jump up them also. Yeah, you can crawl up these stairs. Like you couldn't crawl up those, and it's really awkward. It was during one of those uh, non-commentary or one of the moments where my commentary cut out on me. Oh, I'm monkey. Oh, there's 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 Spectre coin in there. I didn't know that. Ah, oh, he won't get me this. I think he's my right. Yeah! One shot. You can't run far here. Got him. Okay, there we go. I'm surprised I didn't get shot like 15 times there. What's this button do? That helps a little. Does it, does it stay up? That's cool. And that opens the game, I'm guessing. Yeah. Okay, cool. I was actually able. You might be, I think you might be able to somehow lure the monkey onto that switch and just run in that way. I think I did that when I was younger. Because I didn't understand the concept of uh, beating down walls, or beating down, like, touching things that look drastically out of place. But, you know, I've, I think I've already affirmed that I was not the sp I'm better at games now than I was then. And there's a cool Spectre coin. I need to jump across these. I'm probably going to die here. I get the feeling I'm going to die here. Oh god, okay, I almost- Oh, I made it! It's the room of Natalie, where she looks 2D. And, I yeah, this is the room I was talking about earlier. Like, like, long, long time ago. Where I caught two monkeys at the same time, at the same time, because they're all like hiding in the same. Uh... Oh, where are you? They should be hiding in one of these. Okay, <laughs> well I hit the wrong thing, but I guess I'll take that. Ah! <laughs> I'm being overwhelmed. I'm being overwhelmed, Fox. Oh my god, this is so annoying. I got lucky in my practice box. I think, can, oh, can you beat these things up or something? I feel like you can. No, okay, well. No, okay, fell asleep again. No, fell asleep again. Okay. I can pause. I just remember that. I didn't remember that last time. Beat him. Grab him. No mercy. No mercy to the monkeys. That's still the only female character I have remotely care about. I don't know why I say female character, like. Why can't I just say chick or something? I know, I've just heard that the term, uh. This might be being like people. This might be being pe people oversensitive. I you know people are being offensive. Like, uh, girls don't like being called females or something like that. <laughs> I mean, again, it's just that people are being called uh, over. I can kind of understand because someone who's like walked to me and called me a male, or, like people were referring to me as like a male or something. Like, I guess that wouldn't be wouldn't be like technically wrong. It just it just sounds weird. It sounds like more like you're referring to them as like some sort of species rather than like a person. <laughs> and I guess chick or woman. Is more personal. I don't know. Oh, hey! Couldn't you bring me down a little more gently? Well, it's not my fault. <laughs> we can even touch it, woman. Didn't you see that the cage fell on its own? Yeah. 
That's the thanks I get. <laughs> oh. I hope you didn't hit your head too hard. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Somebody's spying his voice. I hope you didn't hit your head too hard. Where is Spectre? I haven't found him yet. What about Jake? I haven't found him either. Nope. <laughs> he tried to kill me though. Oh, what oh. have you been doing all this trying time? Trying to save you. Let's go. We've got to find them. You're supposed to the professor, you know. Where are you going? I'm going back to the lab. We can't find them or beat yes. them without our equipment. Besides, you don't need me here. <laughs> ah! What was that? <laughs> <laughs> that was the last we ever heard of Natalie. Uh, of course she goes out like the worst way possible. Be. I'm just kidding. No, if you leave levels now, she will tell you, Great job! You did something, something! Yay! And of course, the way back, you can take this little roller coaster here. But I'm just, well, there's a couple more monkeys being captured in this area. I'm not sure if you guys noticed, but up to the... Right in front of us, not right in front of us right now, but if you walk down these stairs and head right, there's a little area we can explore, and I think there's one or two monkeys back there we can grab. I'm really hoping that like the recording software didn't screw up on this. <laughs> when the computer went to sleep, now that I think about it, I mean, that would have been a kind of a problem, but you know. I think that's, I haven't dropped any frames or anything, so I'm guessing it's still good. There's just one or two monkeys back here, like we saw this guy earlier, the control freak. Go blow your mind. You're just playing games, so guess what I'm playing? I'm that's playing. I thought I had the sword out, but you know that works too. Anyways, that's the last monkey we can get in this area, and there's actually two more areas for us to explore, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it a part here. So I'll meet you guys back in the main room. Thank you all for watching. I hope you're enjoying it, and I guess at this point, if you're still watching, I'm guessing you're enjoying it or something like that. But yeah, thank you all for watching. I really do appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.